semicolon bookstore is committed to nurturing the connection between literature, art, and the pursuit of knowledge. And now they have expanded with a pop-up bookstore at Kempton Gray Hotel and joining us with more and a few recommendations for Women's History Month is owner Danielle Cano. Oh, oh <laughs> Mullen. And Nae, I'm so, I'm so, uh, Nain Cano. I am so trying so hard to get it right. <laughs> got it, got it. So I just mixed your names up. Either way. So you're Danielle Kano now. Yes. First name, I'm last name. I'm whomever I need to be this morning. <laughs> okay, all right, I love it, I love it. So this pop-up is called Narrative. It is, it is. Tell so us more about it. Our slogan at Semicolon is changing the narrative. Um, and that narrative that we're talking about is showing uh, people of color as readers. Mm -hmm. And so when it was time to do the pop-up at the gray, we had to use that name. It sure. was just perfect. Mm -hmm. We want to give perfect. the narrative of women writers. All mm -hmm. right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we've mentioned the Kempton, but in case someone watching doesn't know, like where is this pop-up? So it's Over. at the Kempton Gray in the financial district downtown, mm -hmm. um, which is an area that obviously does not focus on books by women <laughs> of color or anything by women of color. Um, and so we're happy to have brought that to the neighborhood. All right. Mm -hmm. yeah. So tell us, um, some of the books that are featured in there, are they local artists? Are they around, um, culture, um, uh, around the country, around mm -hmm. the world? T tell us about the artists that you have selected to go into this. Yeah, so all the books featured there are by women of color. Um, so stories, we range from nonfiction, fiction, everything, mm -hmm. but all centered on women of color. Mm -hmm. Ooh. All right. Some okay. of them are local, uh, some of them are all over the world, but either way, you should get to know them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and there are a lot to choose from. Yes. So many. <laughs> yeah, so many. <laughs> yeah, that probably you haven't even heard mm -hmm. of. Yeah, absolutely, and that's what we like to introduce people to. What has the reception been like? It's been interesting. Um, it's been an interesting time. There are people who ask why we mm -hmm. don't have certain Chicago male authors in there. Mm. And it's like, well, it seems pretty obvious that mm -hmm. we're focusing on women. And with it being Women's History Month, like, uh, that doesn't seem like a conversation that needs to be had. But for the most part, everybody's excited that Good. we're there. Good. And that Kenton has been awesome mm -hmm. with with helping us and leading us along okay well, now can you talk a little bit about your collaboration with danny like how do you two work together and, and arrive at these decisions <laughs> i mean is there a heated, heated debate yeah. or is there like do you ever disagree Dan or? Yeah. well danny is the creative force behind semicolon and narrative she's the one that has the big ideas the big vision and then i'm the one that tells her that we need a list first <laughs> before we get going um so i that's definitely how we work um but we are exactly the same person, just opposite sides of the spectrum yeah. of things. Yeah. Yes. Balance each other yeah, out. Well, you you need need that. Need uh, that. Semi yeah. would not could not exist without Nayeen as our GM. She is our fearless mm -hmm. leader. I'm the fearless creator. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is part of a, a, a fundraiser for your not-for-profit mm -hmm. parentheses. parentheses. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, we love what we do with parentheses is we give books away to CPS students. Like, yeah. that's our thing. Mm -hmm. And so every dollar that narrative makes goes to books for CPS students. Oh. Oh, isn't yep. that wonderful? Yep. Well, we don't want to give anything away. Everyone mm -hmm. needs to go to the pop-up and to the flagship That's store. <laughs> but for those watching, can you give us a little teaser? What are you two reading right now? Mm, go ahead. For man. Women's History Month <laughs> in particular. I just reread Tomorrow and Tomorrow and Tomorrow by Gabrielle Zevin. Mm -hmm. It is a phenomenal, phenomenal book. Um, I highly recommend whether you're a reader, whether you're not a reader. It is a gorgeous story. It'll have you crying at Ooh. 2 a.m. in the morning, oh, well. which it has it twice for me in the last year because I've already <laughs> reread it. Re it. Yeah, yeah. I'm still sobbing. Um, yeah. oh, but it's wow. so worth it. It's a gorgeous story. Highly recommend. About? It is about two friends. They meet in childhood. They have a falling out. They reconnect and decide to um, create a video game together. And it just tells their story from there. Oh. It's so sad, so, so beautiful. So sad, so okay. beautiful. Okay. <laughs> All right, I am, a, I like to read funny things. So I'm <laughs> Well, no, thank you, Samantha Irby. Oh, Samantha Irby, her. the love Chicago her. girl, but she is awesome. And while no, thank you, it's really just chatting with your best friend about Ooh. nonsense all day. So if you want to just escape and, and read something that's going to relax you, while no, thank you is that. Relax you, but like in a funny kind of way, <laughs> like you're going to be giggling. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that's what you guys are reading. Do you have recommendations for others out there? Absolutely. I love When We Were Birds. Mm. Uh, it's a non-romantic romance. I don't Ooh, like romance. Non -romantic <laughs> it's a non-romantic romance, but it's one of the 
the most beautiful books I've ever read uh, by Trinidadian author Ayanna Lloyd Bonwo. Uh, but she is awesome. This book will make you want to fall in love. Oh, oh yes. Okay. All right. <laughs> um, my go to recommendation is always Pachinko by Min Jin Lee. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. It is a gorgeous yes. historical fiction. It follows a family um, mm -hmm. through generations mm -hmm. as they immigrate from Korea to Japan. And it just, it's yeah. Oh, it's a must read for absolutely the everyone. Background history of yes. hatred between the two countries yes, exactly. that are right next door. And Min Jin Lee does a yeah. phenomenal job yeah. at researching her books so everything's like historically accurate mm -hmm. and it's just a beautiful story. Mm -hmm. um, but we've been following you since you started. Yes, We're so proud crazy. of your accomplishments you. and Thank what you two you. are now doing together. It's yeah. incredible. Thank you so much, Danielle and Nahin, for being with us. And there's all the information there on your screen. And it recently got ex uh, extended, right? It Till did. April. And we're, here, we're there through April. We're there until they kick us out. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Well, I don't think that's going to happen. No, I don't know. Thank you guys for joining us. Thank you. Thank you right. so much.